I'm the reason why Armenia and Azerbaijan have border conflicts right now. Where's the yeah thing? Come on. We were working so hard. That was way too late. Sorry, my phone like just went blank for a second. Anyway. That is that was a timely joke too. Sorry, it <laughs> you can't blame me. Okay, I got another one. I got another one. Fine. Hi, I'm Todd Howard and I'm the reason why Rad Rex's phone is so delayed. Yeah! All right. All right, and I am Rad Rex and I am Craig. Oh my god. All right, let's go. Oh, this is some good music. Mm hmm So, recently, I actually decided to check out Super Robot Wars for the GBA. Alright. I did not like it. I gave it... I'm sorry, what? I didn't like it. Okay, can you lower the volume of the game? Oh my god. I'm having a hard time hearing you. Uh, it's at the lowest. Let me try lowering it from here. Okay, because that was strange. Because, like, we were having a normal conversation, and all of a sudden the music got really loud when you were saying you didn't like something. <laughs> I didn't like Super Robot Wars. On the GBA? Yeah. Aw, oh, man. I'm sorry. Too I much text. That and... Much it just looked too anime-ish for me. And I'm a fan of anime, but this looked... Very bad to me. I'm sorry. If you want to see how anime Super Robot Wars gets, you should see some of the stuff on the Switch where they have literal Gundam series introduced in it. Like, say, Fighter G Gundam. Boom, you can play as them. Gundam Unicorn. Boom, you can play as them. I'm sorry. I just didn't like it. Like, it's not... I can see the appeal, but it is just not for me. Oh, man. I mean, I can definitely see why you like it. It's very strat, like strat. It can get difficult at times too. Yeah, but it just wasn't fun for me. It felt too much like Advance Wars for some reason. If that makes sense. Well, Advance Wars and it comes off of Famicom Wars, and I think they copied off of Super Robot Wars. Yeah, but Sorry I just. About that. Is that a burp? I could not tell what the hell that was. I I kept a burp, burp in my mouth so it didn't come out. Ah. All right, let's talk. Anissa, how do you fare? I know this fight must be particularly hard on you. Hard on me? Kasuma, you and I both know that I recall nothing of my infancy. I was adopted and brought to Kaching after a skirmish on the border and raised as a Kaching. My blood is Nevesian, but my heart is in Kaching. Yes, but it's still your home, is it not? I look out into Nevan and I feel nothing. Even in the state of Lomsk, where I was born, it means nothing more. Kusuma, much like you fight <coughs> for your homeland, I fight for mine. So please, don't worry about this. Yes, Kaching really is your home. I apologize for questioning you, Anissa. I'm glad you're on our side. Don't worry about it, Kusuma. I know you mean well. Let's go. Anissa, nice shot. I was a little off. That last cavalry man could have fallen on one of our own. I should have hit a little more to the left to knock him back. This isn't the archery range, this is the battlefield. Perfection is impossible. Survival is paramount. Trying for perfection in Minecraft can be done anywhere. The battlefield merely presents new challenges for me. You're starting to sound like Kuda. Well, he was like an uncle to me growing up. He was the one who introduced me to the bow. Mm-hmm. The Dark Stallion himself. Regardless, Anissa, please be safe out here. It, I can't keep both eyes on you. Don't worry about me, but thanks. And then they bone. All right. They bumped? They bone. Oh, that's a weird way of saying they fuck. What? You've never heard someone say that before? I guess so. And yet you, and yet you criticize me for being old. Now let me tell you something, you young whippersnapper. <laughs> Back in my day, we had dial-up internet. Dial-up internet? What the hell is that? 
It was what internet used to be like before we had Wi-Fi broadband and whatnot. Ah, okay. We, it was so no! bad. So, so I bad. missed. <laughs> like the internet back then was so slow that you had to literally go on a phone line, and if someone called, you lost your connection. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it was that bad. Back to oh my god! Uh, okay, I, I get it. You have a soundboard. But as I was saying... Com oh. oh, Commander Stroganov! Oh, Stroganov. God damn it. What is with all the foods? Where are we? In the freaking Dragon Ball universe again? I'm pretty sure that... Up? I'm pretty sure that was not Stroganov. No, Stroganov is a food. No, I'm pretty sure that wasn't his name. I mean, he called him Commander Stroganov. I think that's his fucking name. Check the spelling. We'll check the spelling after we're done here. Chief Wally's force. I'm not even gonna really? try to say that anymore. Really? Chief Waluyo. See what I mean? Good enough. Waluyo. It's like Waluigi or some shit. I'm just gonna call Wally, okay? I've broken out of the fortress. Captain Rizma has fallen. So this chief has some fight in him to charge straight through Hop Raisin. Be on your guard. We will not let him pass. Reinforcements will assist us from the fort. We will surround them all. Oh no. What the hell? I wonder if they take that gate on your castle, they win. I doubt it. Oh, okay. For saying that, I thought I killed her. Oh, nice. Reinforcements. Nice. Duke. Ka Kaijin? Kajan? I'll go with Kajin. Duke Kajin. I see them. Smashing. Simply smashing. Good to see our dear Chief Wally hasn't fallen in his life yet. The rambunctious rapscallion would not give up so easily. Your orders? Steiner, my boon companion, you wound me. For you know, if we all added to orders as well as you do, we would be sitting back in the manse having tea and a biscuit. Musing over the latest court gossip, we are Mustin's finest. <laughs> We will join Wally and drive out the Devonese. Charge! His... The moment I saw Smashing, I instantly thought of Nigel Thornberry. <laughs> I'm sorry. His theatrics really are too much. All right, we got oh, some. You haven't seen the Well Thornberries, I think, kid. <laughs> All right, so let's take a Kajan Kajan. I'm going with Kajan just because. All right, K or Kajon. Kajon. Okay. Kajan. Kajan, we'll just call, I'll call him that. And it, an affable noble from Mustin, he seems to have balanced that. Affable. You added like five extra syllables. And affable. What did I say? An affable. Oh, an affable noble from Mustin. There we go. So he comes with Kanto, has balanced stats for a cavalier, has not good strength, but everything else seems pretty fine, and he comes with. Charm, which is always nice. I do like stat skills like that on units. And B rank and lances. Nice. All right. And then he has Stina. And I'm pretty sure this is a girl. Night of Mustin, beautiful and intense. This looks like a girl. I'm pretty sure. And she, com guy. she comes with reposition. I'm pretty sure this is a girl. This has to be. Then again, Stina. But at the same time, it could be one of those uh, unisex names where we just fuck with them. This can't be a real name. She comes okay, with. Let me check she, oh, here. great. And she seems alright. And her growth rates are much better than uh, Kajan, so I'm, I think I might be yeah, using it. Yeah, it is a woman's name. What? That cannot be a real name. Very uncommon. Because when I op looked up Steina, the top results I had all showed pictures of women, so I'm like, yeah, this is a woman. Oh, nice. She crit. Alright. Smashing. Smashing. Simply smashing, I see. Alright, so... Um, so we just have to defeat the boss. So let me see. This, uh, 
So his name is Stro Okay, I guess it is strong enough. But look at that luck, though. Oh my god, three luck. But he's got two leadership stars. Alright, so I think I'm going to have them make their way down here. But over here, I'm going to have Walio crit this... Yep, crit this bow user. There we go. Nice. Oh my god, he gets, like, no experience. Alright, steel bow. Nice. So now I can stop wasting my killer bow. And let's see. Anissa can... Oh, nice. Oh, the sky piercer. That... What the hell? Oh, wait. I thought it was effective against flyers, but I guess not. Alright, nice work. And almost a level up. Okay, nice. That is nice. Alright, and then Surya, I guess... Oh my god. Alright. Crit, please. Nice! Hey, you finally got your critical bandit attack. Nice! And it took you, what, oh. 50 hacks to get it? Twice. Twice in a row. Oh my god. That's pretty hard to get. Yeah. I wonder if I'll actually use this guy. I have no idea how, like, the... Um, how these two, like, forces are gonna join up. Alright. Uh, carefully. Here, let's talk with Surya. That's quite an axe you wield, friend. Thank you. And you are? Named Surya, Chief Walio's right-hand man, his best pal, and comrade in arms. We go way back to when we were small. You're from Lamsk, aren't you? Yes, I'm Kyr. I am a knight of the garrison on the border. This axe was something I purchased to scare recruits into thinking that I was not to be trifled with. You need an axe to show you're tough? You shaved your head. That's intimidating enough for me. Ha, huh, I like your attitude, Surya. I look forward to having you alongside me. You bet. I love fighting with a fellow Axe brother. Glad to have you. Try to keep up. Surya, there he goes. His energy and zeal are palpable. This will certainly be an interesting adventure. I'll wait until you see how many people I've gotten killed. Then you'll find that interesting. I feel like I've gotten like six people in this hack killed. Like That or like half the cast is dead by now. It points strength, speed, and defense. Oh my god, he got speed as an armor knight, and he has a 30% chance. I love that. Okay, Michael. Wait, does this guy have a heavy spear? No, he has a sapphire lance. All right. <coughs> Let's just dance for Surya, and then have him kill the armor knight. Oh my god, this guy's insane. Oh, nice. Another crit. I love that. Alright, level up for Surya. Please be a good one after getting so many crits. Hit points, strength, skill, speed. Yes! And he got Intimidate. He got his level 15 skill. Yep, Intimidate. My ascent avoid to all enemies within two tiles. I think I'm going to promote him, actually. Alright, so let's heal up or mend Kusuma. And then I think... How does Kasuma do against these guys? Not well. <coughs> uh, she can support with Walio. How many supports do I have, actually? Uh, hmm. Uh, hmm. I guess I can just have her take on this axe fighter that's coming in. Alright, here comes the soldiers. Miss... Oh my god, I got another crit. That's four crits in a row he's gotten. Can we get a number five in? Okay, hey, please dodge, Kasuma. Thank you. Nice, she doubles. Okay. Come on, can we get another crit in? Miss. Oh my god, that's five crits in a row. Jesus. This man is truly unbelievable. He... We Do you see what you get, Carla? You see what you get when you hit the Surya? Oh my god! <laughs> I might as well make this a drinking game. Oh my god. Can you get another good level up? Hit points strength. Okay, I'll take that. I'm going to promote this guy as soon as I get a Master Seal. Okay. Oh my god, he dodged. Oh man, no crit. Alright. 
Let's see. Oh, Wyvern Rider. Okay. Miss. Oh, I missed a 90%. Are you fucking kidding me? That doesn't happen every day. All right. So after Surya's uh, crit streak, it's time. I think I actually do have a Master Seal. Yeah, it's on Kira. I think I'm going to... Okay, Corn, so you decide. Who do I promote? Surya or Kira? Surya at this point. All right. Let's do it. All right, give me that Earth Seal, and let's promote. I mean, I already got his level 15 skill, so there's no point not to. And he is a Berserker. Oh, my God. And he just got a whole lot better. Five hit points, two strength, three skill, one speed, two defense, and three resistance. Good. And we basically just got a god on our side. I think he, oh my god, I feel like he outclasses Walio now. A guy that just joined with busted stats. And we can shoot down this Wyvern Rider. There we go. Thank you, come again please. And Asuma, she's about to hit level 15, so we can just kill this Axe Fighter. And she can get a level 15 skill. I wonder what hers is. I don't think I've gotten an Archer with a level 15 skill. Hit points and skill. Okay, Archer level up at its finest. And that is Certain Blow, I believe. Let's see. Yep, 30% more hit when initiating combat. That is really good to have on an Archer. Though I would take Death Blow, but you know what? Beggars can't be choosers, am I right? Alright, let's mend up Cure, because he took quite a beating. And let's see, how does he do against this guy? Alright. Let's try hitting him with the Hand Axe. And he actually hit. Nice. Alright, and then I'm going to play for Surya and have him get this kill. Michael level up. Level 11. For sub up, hit point speed, luck, defense. Nice. I always love getting those levels on my bard. Oh my god. Oh, that's right. He can walk on water now. He is literally god. <laughs> well, truly, Surya must be the son of god. <laughs> And he reacts by doing what he did before. <laughs> Critical. Oh my god, now that he's a berserker, he's not going to be able to scream anymore. It's okay. He screamed enough for a lifetime. Yeah, he screamed like six times in a row. That was insane. Alright, got a light rune. That's, uh, you know, I always love getting an item that I could care less about. Because of those screams, we gave him a promotion. He, he earned it. Jesus Christ, he got good level ups. Oh no. God damn it. Are you serious? God. Uh. The enemy's coming from behind! Oh, great. Can I do. Oh, man. Okay. Alright, stick. I have no idea how to pronounce these guys' names. Like, they're getting so hard to pronounce. I feel like it's because they're foreign that they're hard to pronounce. All right, so I think I'll just have, you know, I'll just have, Surya is literally like Arcady and, and Vagalus at this point. I can literally just, now I just need to have him support with someone and I think I'm golden actually. All right. And I literally have Vagalus and Arcady in literally on the same team. It's like nothing changed. All right, so I need to block this bridge. Two good units, and unfortunately I only got one good unit with me right now. All right, hit points, skill, speed, luck, nice. And that is, what is that skill? That is live to serve. I love that skill. Thank you so much. All right, and I think we're good here. Yep. All right, let's see what happens. Okay, ow. What the hell? That is a very bad animation. Jesus Christ. Okay. Dodge. Nice job, Sina. Oh, yeah. This is a girl, actually. She has got long hair. Okay, so I was actually right. Yes, I was right. Okay. Kajan. Not doubling. Nice. Dodge. Nice job, Surya. Damn. I'm starting to think he's trying to spite us. 
Uh, okay, Steina out. 33, really? Come on. Okay. Uh, oh god, that's an archer. Ow. Oh no, that's a sniper, actually. Oh my god, are you serious? There's more of them. And this boss doesn't move. Great, so we're going to be dealing with these reinforcements for quite some time. Looking forward to it. Yeah, wait, is this, oh, there's a fort over here. I didn't even notice that. Okay, nice. Anissa can just kill this guy. And thanks to her getting certain blow, she's able to just hit him. And Kasuma, okay, please don't get hit. Thank you. All right, nice job, Kasuma. That's level 14, one level away from getting your level 15 skill. Strength, skill, speed, and luck. Nice. Oh, I just remembered something. What? Have you tried out the uh, demo for the Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity yet? Not yet, actually. What were your thoughts on that, on that by the way? I pre-ordered it. Oh, you pre-ordered it. Nice. Yeah. I like how in the demo, any data you have can be brought over to the game. So it's like, that helps out. That is a With nice... what I see of it so far, yeah, I'm getting that. Yeah, it's a nice I mean, feature. I... I like it when games have that feature. I mean, I like the first game, Hyrule Warriors... And with what I see, this seems to be, this seems to me better than Breath of the Wild. But then again, some people will say, no, that's stupid. Breath of the Wild is the greatest game ever. And I'll say, I'm an asshole. <laughs> well, the thing is, though, that I've seen some footage from the, from the uh, demo, and it looks very choppy. Yeah, that's when you have the major attacks when there's a lot of enemies. But then again, that happens a lot with like all the Warriors games. Uh, what Warrior games are you playing? Cause that did not happen to me. Well, let's see. Hyrule Warriors on the Switch had the same thing to me. Dynasty Warriors 8 had the same thing happen to me. Dynasty Warriors 3 had the same thing happen to me. So it's a, and then there was that spin-off Trojan War on a PS3 I played for a bit that had the same thing. Okay, I do not remember that ever happening to me, but all right. I mean, I played Dynasty Warriors 8 and 9. Oh, you played 9? Yeah, I'm I know. I'm so sorry. I know. Don't, like, I already feel bad. Anissa, you're off in a rush in a rush today, aren't you? How can you be so casual, Kitsu? We just escaped the jaws of death, and you want to chat? If you haven't noticed, we still, have, we still need to keep moving fast. Oh, trust me, I understand how dire things are, but I wanted to ask you something. I want to make sure you're doing okay through it all. You're always so stoic and stone-faced. It is hard to know how you are truly feeling is all. Is that it? Shouldn't you be tending to our wounds? I'm not done yet. I am. And we'll both be done for if we sit here like it's Sunday tea. I just... I just want to make sure you're okay. We're both fighting under the same banner of Wall... I mean, Chief Walio. I want to get to know you a bit better, Anissa. I didn't join the army to make friends. Especially not right now. But what about later? Kitsu, I understand you're trying to be friendly. I also recognize that you're being kind and checking in on me, but this is probably the worst time to pry into my personal life. I'd rather not catch an axe in my back discussing my hopes and dreams. If we make it out of here alive, actually, I don't want to promise that. Hmm? Anissa? Keep moving, Kitsu. Wow, what a bitch. Alright. Dodge out. Okay, thank God she didn't get doubled. Dodge out. Oh, nice. Okay, another crit. Nothing's nothing to see here. Okay, dodge. Nice, Kajan. Unfortunately, he doesn't double because he is slow as crap. Nice. Okay, so far so good. Oh, geez, that wyvern runner is coming in hot. Oh my god, more reinforcements. Jesus Christ. Hey, Walio, please hit this. No! Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. You missed it 85%. My dude, what are you doing? Well, you see, it all began when I was born. Oh my, god. my parents didn't show up for the day I was born in the hospital. So they didn't know who I was actually the, parent, the, the kid of. So they sent me straight to the orphanage. Unfortunately, this orphanage was run by a saloon salesman who sold saloons. Saloon? What? 
What are you talking about? I'm telling you why he failed to hit by telling you his life story. Oh, okay. And then in the year 1911 to 12, I at don't... the age of eight, he went to a frat party where he became <laughs> the frat... youngest frat oh. boy ever. A frat party? Really? You see, the saloon salesman also owned his own dormitory at a university. You probably heard of this university. It's called the University of Motherfucking Assholes. <laughs> Nice. I love this backstory. Ten said... years later, he would become the very first quarterback <laughs> to the worst football team to ever exist. <laughs> and it has been a legacy ever since. <laughs> I love this backstory. I swear, you need to like write this like as a fan. Chief Walio fan fiction. I want it in the comment section right now. Right now. Chief Wally would also write his own fan fictions about Garfield. <laughs> oh no. No, we're not. That? No! Okay, we're not bringing that back. But those stories were so funny. Yeah, but no. Okay? No, we're. At we least you agreed with me. At least you agreed with me by saying, yeah, but. We are not bringing that back. That is a rule. We are not going back down on this channel. Chief scale. Wally also washes paper plates. <laughs> Oh, no, that is not good. Ow. Yeah, I know. That's a terrible idea to do. Why would you no, wash paper plates? That's not what I'm talking about. Oh, God. He also goes 40 and a 60 no, on the street. No! On the, in the left lane. Oh, God, please. In other words, the worst thing to do. The left lane is the fast lane, people. Yeah. Fucking hell. Dodge! Oh, my God. Don't tell me we sentenced him to death because of his No! Dodge. No! Dodge! No, no, it's a 62. Please, 62. dodge! No! Oh my god! You've got to be fucking kidding me. We we praised him, and this is what he does for us? Uh, you think you can stop me? What's all this blood? Why am I so dizzy? Uh, guess they got me. I'll just lay down. This looks like a fine spot. What the hell is this? Now I'll close my eyes and... Yeah, that was this a... reminds me of Alex. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh my... it'd be fun, they said. And then it's just, oh, I'll just take forever. Okay. Uh... Yeah, let's keep going. We don't, we don't need him. Okay, we're good. We got cure, okay? Oh my god, that was... Oh my god, and he got such good level ups too. Oh my god, I'm so pissed right now. What a great time to be come back, am I right? I can think of other ideas. Okay, Kasuma, please hit this. Don't pull a Surya. Thank you. Well, that's another guy to add to the death list, I have to say. Oh my god, this guy is so annoying. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's heal up Anissa. Alright, and I need to hope that Anissa can kill this Wyvern Rider. I hope she can. Alright, Anissa, please. Wait, what about Sky Piercer? Damn it, you don't kill. God damn it, you're so bad. Oh my god. Well, there goes my Earth Seal. <laughs> Strength, nice. Maybe we should reset, but at the same time, did you have a safe state set ahead of time? No. That's your own damn fault. We don't. Why would you push everyone like him so far out with no one else around him? We don't need him, okay? We have. You. He made like seven trillion criticals of the killer axe in this one chapter alone. We gave him an Earth Seal to show how much we needed him, and now somehow we don't need him. We don't need How him. much crap have you consumed in five minutes? We don't need him, okay? We're fine. See? Oh my fucking god! What are these hit rates? What are these hit rates? Oh my god, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh, that dodges! That dodges! Okay, okay. Wow, alright. Okay. Yeah, this is fair. This is totally fucking fair. Oh my fucking god, I am so pissed right now. Hit? Oh! Okay, that hits. Got it. 
This game is so... Oh my god. Alright, hit point, strength, speed, luck, nice cure, you cap strength, and you got... What is that? That is... Uh, natural cover. Nice. Okay. Okay, and now I'm going to... Oh my god. Why are, are you so bad in this? Uh, god damn it. Okay, can these shamans actually double him? No, they can't. Okay. Sky Pier nope. Brave bow. Oh nice, she crits. But that is not enough to kill. God damn it. Hey, I got a good joke. Ready to hear it? What? PlayStation Vita. What? That's the joke. I don't get it. Oh my gosh. Okay, you see, there's this game system called the PlayStation I know Vita. what the PlayStation Vita is. So you know why it's the joke. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. The, you're saying the PlayStation Vita was a joke. Yeah. You, you didn't catch on? No. My gosh, I feel like I'm going to let my inner Zev out on you at this moment. All right, so let's see. Kazuma got Forager is her level 15 skill. Recovers 20% HP. Each turn if on a plain, a forest, or mountain. That's nice. And she's on a forest. So next turn she'll recover. If she lives, that is. I have I don't have high hopes. But let's see if she lives. And I missed that, of course, like a pro. Alright. Uh Kajan, please hit this. Thank you. If I lose another unit, then I'll actually contemplate doing a restart. Alright. Alright. Let's just move in. And... No! Come on! Stop! Alright, Kajan, first level up. Let's see what you get. Hit points, luck, defense. Okay, got it. And you learn chivalry. Nice. Ow. Okay. God, this map is insane. Dodge, Kasuma. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Yes! Dodge, 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 dodge. Yes! I am so lucky. See, we don't need... Okay, thank God. I actually got a read there. See, we don't need Surya. He's too, he's, he's too meta. That's why we don't need him. Okay, and the reinforcements have stopped. All right. Oh my god, this, these guys Oh are... wow. There's a new wrestling game coming out in the future. For a company called AEW. It is an alpha. And the guy that worked on WWF No Mercy is working on it. Oh wait, by the way, what did you think? Have you played WWE 2K Battlegrounds yet? No, it looks like shit. Okay, good. The last wrestling game I bought was uh, this one on the PS2 called King of Colosseum 2. I think I told you guys about that. Basically, it runs on the... Uh, it's made by the people who make Fire Pro Wrestling. Ah. Like, for PS3, PS... Like, there haven't been a lot of... Like, the PS2 and the Nintendo 64 have the best wrestling games. If it's any other system, eh, not so much. PS1 and whatnot, they had good ones here and there, but like the PS2 and the N64 had the best ones. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like, remember WWF No Mercy? But the, but the Nintendo 64 didn't have a whole lot of third-party support, though, so... And yet the third-party support they got for the wrestling games were great. That is debatable on my part, I must oh, say. Oh, come on. I don't play How wrestling games. Th oh my gosh, you are missing out on some good fun cheese. I don't think I am. Because it's cheesy action. See, you it's say that, you say that, but I don't think I am. See, I, fi again, I find doubt in your words. You find doubt in a lot of things, like the time I told you that coffee was good for you. Coffee is bad for you, okay? <laughs> it gives you heart disease. I tell my brother this and he doesn't believe me. Well, okay. Name five things that do not give you heart disease. Burger King. 
<laughs> that is the number See? one thing that will give you heart disease. See what I mean? There's no such. Everything gives you heart disease. If you think about Holy it really sh! Hard. Oh god, Jesus Christ, these guys are insane. Now, if you excuse me, I have to smoke this stick of butter to prove you wrong. <laughs> oh god, uh, Walio, how do you do against this guy? Okay, um, I think we might be fucked here, actually. Uh, huh. Uh, Cure, if you could hit this, that'd be fantastic. Thank you, Cure. Maybe we should have gave the Earth Seal to him. Yeah, he's actually capped strength, and he's about to cap defense. He also didn't die. Anyway, uh, let's see. Walio, I need you to shoot down one of these Wyvern Riders, please. Please Did hit. Say shit down? Shoot down. I, shit. I said I shoot. I shit down. <laughs> Do you want me to say shot down? Like, I need you to shot down this. Shoot down, shot down. Okay. I misheard it. Then again, my whole mind has been one big Freudian slip today. I do not know what that is. Is that like some sort of Everything, like... I just, it's a, don't worry about it. I was going to say, is that like another word for anus? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love how you just got silent all of a sudden. I'll try to comprehend what I heard. Hey, Kasuma, please crit. That'd be fantastic. Nope. Okay. What else is new? Got it. My luck. Thank you. Uh, okay. I'm kind of scared here. Um, all right, I got to shoot down this Wyvern. Otherwise, he's going to kill someone. Thank you, Anissa. Finally. Useful. Okay, and then I'm just gonna body block him like this. Nope, that is not a good body block. Never mind. Okay. Okay, good John. Please hit this. Thank you. Okay, we gotta kill this boss now, otherwise we're gonna lose someone. Oh god, these guys move fast. Oh my god, there's more of them. Okay. Uh, just going to mend up Walio, and then I think I actually have a conversation between Kajan and Walio. Yeah, we do. All right, let's do this. Grins. Oh, I'm sorry. I was kind of zoned out. Uh, Wally, my old friend, well met. Kajan, my heart is full. Thank you for coming. But I thought Mustin would not involve itself in the conflict. I come not as your duke, but as your friend. Is that wrong? I am forever indebted to you, friend. Thank you. Enough of this talk. Let us pray we live so we can repay this debt. There. Your debts are easily repaid. Gossip, women, and tea time meals. <coughs> shall, for, shall we arrange for it when this is all over, Duke John? My dear Chief Waller, you paint me as far too simple a man. But are these not the pleasures that make for a fine living? I certainly say so, but no matter, let's go. <laughs> I hate this voice so goddamn much, but because I hate him, I'm keeping it for him. Well, you hate this guy, but you gave him that voice? I mean, if you hate someone, you give him a bad voice, right? You know, like, when you give someone a voice like this. You know what I mean? No. I don't understand that logic whatsoever. Well, I mean, when you're trying to, like, mockingly impersonate someone, you give them, like, a... Ah, voice. okay. Now you're making... Now, uh, you're, now you're speaking words. Okay, now I get it. No, no. I'm speaking Radrex words. Oh, okay. You're, yeah, you're speaking my species. Now I get what you mean. <laughs> All right. And this, uh, you're attacking me directly. A bold move, but I'll have you know that those who cross me never get a second chance. Wait, someone's actually attacking me? Wow, that's- Oh crazy. my Nobody's god! Saying... Is that Wario? Yeah. I didn't even know Wario said, oh my god. Yeah, he says it in like the, in the Nintendo 64 Mario Party games. 
Like when he I loses, don't remember those. When he loses, he goes like, "Oh my god!" I remember "Do I Miss" from two. That must be. Do I missed. That's the one. Yeah, I love when he goes like, "Do I miss?" Okay, Anissa, please hit these two, please. I'm begging you. Thank you. Okay, I didn't want to hit. Do I miss? My emperor, I failed you. That's wow. a fucking N64 reference for Star Fox 64, if I ever saw one. Remember the first boss in Star Fox 64, the big walking robot? No, because... My emperor, I failed you. Oh, that's... The... I thought you were talking about the music. <laughs> what a battle. My good man, your horse riding has improved. Tell me, where to next? To the graveyard. I am amazed at how lighthearted you are. We head north. There isn't much time. They will continue to pursue us. Of this, I am certain. Actually, let's go. Shut, saddle up. Alright, nice. 3 3, protect and serve. Just like a police officer. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Kaching cuisine. Oh god. Cuisine is unique throughout the continent. Predominantly. Hey everybody, we're back to those Yelp reviews. <laughs> Predom predominantly focused on what can be forged from its fast planes. While some spe species were domesticated, such as the horse, others, such as cows and goats, were introduced from Mustin and Navan in certain centuries past and are a staple in Kaching meat dishes. Spices and herbs are harvested to add pung pungency and heat to meals. On cold nights, a spicy meal is often enough to forget the frigid air biting at ears. Soldiers and town guards often indulge in spicy meals before a shift to heighten their alertness when they can only see shadows in the light of the moon. Sir, sure, have you enjoyed your stay in our little village? You know it isn't often we get visitors around these parts. Especially with a war going on. You gonna be alright out there? Yes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That fucking forehead is making me laugh. It's I'm, it, let me try that again. Okay. Yes, thank you. What was this dish you prepared? It's delicious. That's a local favorite. We grow the potato locally up in the hills nearby. And cook it with some beef, a few spices to make gravy, a little bit of this and that. Usually whatever we can scrape together to craft the dish. We call it curry. Curry. It is yummy. I will remember that. It's not yummy. You don't like curry? This He had to have eaten I hate curry. You have made an enemy for life, you know. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you and the other like three people that like curry. My sisters enjoy curry. Okay, so then that's five right now. And I believe Zev likes Indian food too, last time I talked to him. How is curry in considered Indian? Curry originates from India. No, it do you're lying. The curry food dishes originate from India, but we can talk about that later. First things first is I have to get back to Captain Forehead. <laughs> and the sheep, is it always so spicy? Depends on your taste. Usually Nevesian can't handle such things, but you're rather good at it. Have you traveled around a lot? Gucci. Usually, folks who enjoy our spice food tend to be more worldly and also will hear a weird noise. All travel source with pilots as divine as the gods. Hmm, with my wyvern I could go anywhere. I am happy. Excuse me? I am happy as soon as sky. Thank you again for the meeting. I will learn to make curry on my own next time. Not if I kill you first. No, town guard, this will be easy. Gather around, everyone. Your lives will be spared. You just need to come with me. What? Who are you? We're from... Batman. We're never from Navan. We've invaded your borders. Come quietly or die. Oh no, please. Leave these nice people alone. They did nothing wrong. Hmm? What are you doing here? You're Nevesian too. Sitting, siding with the enemy? That's it. You're coming with me. I don't think so. Everyone, we must run quickly. We've got your little hamlet surrounded. There's no running. Don't say we didn't warn you. Oh my god. My good man, nightfall is upon us. Uh, you know, I'm gonna try to make him sound like one of those, like, southern judges. Southern. Shall we shut up camp for the evening? 
You know these lands better than I. All I see are the plains. Besides, I'd love to retire early so we can have a proper chat. We've barely been able to exchange pleasantries since our rendezvous. My dear friend Yuka John, there will be time for pleasantries after we find safety. But yes, there should be a small village nearby. Perhaps we can rest there for the evening? I'm sure that given the circumstances, they'd be willing to provide shelter. Fair enough, my dear good chief. Are we still in your territory? I don't quite understand the fluid nature of Kachingi politics. In times of peace, borders are not are not thought of heavily. It is only in times of dispute that this becomes contagious. The other chiefs and I shall occupy particular areas and keep to ourselves. Even if we were to cross into another's territory, it wouldn't be problematic. How intriguing. It really isn't much different than the various dukedoms of most time. While the king is the centralizing authority, I have much free reign. Yes, it is nice. Mustin is black and white. Kaching is much more nuance. It causes difficulty, for sure. I remember when you first visited Mustin. You told me you sought to unite all of Kaching. Do you still wish to be the chief of all Kaching? Like a king of sorts. That is a strong word, my friend. To unite the people as one, it is my goal. It would give us much strength in times like these. But old loyalties prevail, and many would not follow me. I am still a young leader. But with wisdom beyond your years, I know it. Chief, Duke Kajan. Ah, Kasuma. How do things look up ahead? The Messian forces are moving in. There's a few villagers holding out. We should rush to their aid. What? They've come this far. This means Hydron's forces must be. No time to think, Chief. Let us swoop into action. Right, let's go. Alright, let's take a look at the map. And, oh, it's Fog of War. Great. Oh, great. This is awesome. Okay, and while I was saying about curry, Wikipedia. Curry is a variety of dishes originating in the Indian subcontinent. India, that, that article must be lying. Well, let's take a look at the first citation that says this. <laughs> it comes from an archived article from someplace called NPR 2018. NPR? Really? Fresh curry leaves add a touch of India. Okay, I can see why. That's a strange... Like, you think they get from, like, say, an actual study book, not, like, some article from some blog post. Okay, maybe you're right on this, but here it shows history. Archaeological evidence dating to 2600 BC in the Mohenjo Daro, which is around the India-Pakistan border, suggests... So, Indian subcontinent, but it's not entirely all India. The use of mortar and pestle to pound spices, including mustard, fennel, cumin, and tamarind pods, which, with which they flavored food. Black pepper is native to the subcontinent and Southeast Asia, and has been known to Indian cooking since at least 2000 BC. The establishment of the Mughal Empire in the 15th century AD also influenced some curries, especially in the north. Along Oh, wait, another influence was the establishment of the Portuguese Trading Center in Goa in 1510, resulting in the introduction of chili pepper, tomatoes, and potatoes to India from the Americas, as a byproduct of the Colombian exchange. Curry was introduced to English cuisine, started with the Anglo-Indian cooking in the 17th century as spicy sauces were added to plain, boiled, and cooked meats. So yeah, it starts in India. Or uh, the Indian subcontinent, to be more precise. That article must be a lie. I don't believe it. Now, when it comes to food, I don't think Wikipedia lies. The internet lies, okay? It's full of lies. Now we're going to get to that one meme from that Arthur episode. You think people just go on the internet just to lie? <laughs> Aaron... I think that's a good Buster impersonation. <laughs> they should put me on the show. What do you mean, Arthur? I only checked off the closet twice. Yeah, that's how the show goes, right? I mean, it's on PBS. Nobody actually watches it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Join us next time. Have a good one. Take care of yourselves. We'll see you next time.